Hey guys, welcome back to Easy Country Cooking. I was in the Amish store the other day poking around and I came across this Amish recipe, actually a casserole, so I decided to change it up a whole bunch and it actually came out like an Amish hamburger helper and it is incredibly good. So let me share this with you and show you how to do it. First thing we're gonna do is throw two cups of egg noodles into some salted boiling water. Now, of course, these don't have to be egg noodles, guys. You can use any kind of noodles. I just like the egg noodles because they cook a little bit faster, but it's entirely up to you. Next up, grab up some oil and into a pan over medium high heat. Then in with a pound or half a kilo of ground beef. So we'll just go ahead and spend a few minutes and break this down and fry it up. Funny, I keep saying that ground beef is so versatile. I mean, there's so many dishes you can make with it. Now, I'm using a medium ground beef here, guys. You know, you can use a, a lean, but I just like that little bit of extra fat on there. This adds a nice touch to the dish. Next up, we are going in with three cloves of chopped garlic and a small chopped onion. And something I usually do is shove all the beef over to one side of the pan. That helps saute up that onion and garlic. So we'll just stir and saute this all for about two or three minutes. Then just kind of go ahead and give everything a good mix together. Man, oh man, this is smelling so good, guys. Now one of my all-time favorites, a can of tomato or tomato soup. And I don't know, tomato soup has to be one of the greatest comfort foods out there. Let me know what you think in the comment section. A can of cream of mushroom soup, I guess is about my second favorite soup. And I suppose you could use cream of asparagus, cream of chicken, you know, whatever you like that's creamy. Then a cup of good old 2% milk. That's milk for you guys who don't live in Dave's Bizarro world. Grab up the old spoon and mix everything together until it becomes nicely combined. Then we are going to season this up with a few good cracks of ground black pepper. Maybe a teaspoon or two. Now I'm not using salt because I find that soup is salty enough, but you know, entirely up to you. And you know me guys, a couple of good teaspoons of my all-time favorite seasoning, some Italian seasoning. Just got to have the old Italian seasoning. I guess I like it so much because it's got a little bit of everything in it. Alrighty then, a tablespoon of Worcester sauce. Just for some of that British flavor. Once again, it's during we will go and look at this creaminess. Yum. This is smelling so, so good. And I'm keeping it pretty basic here. I mean, you know, you could add in whatever you like. You could add in some corn, green beans. You know, the sky's kind of the limit. But, you know, just for your sake, I'm keeping it pretty simple. So just do as you please. Mm, but this is smelling good. Of course, you probably guessed it by now. In we go with those egg noodles. One final stir until everything is beautifully combined. And doesn't this look rich, creamy, and ever so yummy? I mean, just check this out. To me, this is looking pretty darn good. Alrighty then, we shall just go ahead and plate this up. And I mean, I don't know about you, but you've got to have lots and lots and lots of this on the plate. Now to finish this up, a few good sprinkles of Parmesan cheese. And to make it all pretty, some chopped parsley. And there it be, guys, in all its glory, our Amish hamburger helper invented and revised by none other than Dave himself of Easy Country Cooking. All right, let's go ahead and grab some of this up and give it a taste test. Oh, boy, this looks creamy and good. Mmm. Yep. I was right, because it is, it is really creamy because of the... Um, the cream of mushroom soup and the tomato soup absolutely combined together are fantastic. The little bit of seasoning is just great. The egg noodles are cooked perfectly, the hamburger. Simple, easy midweek meal and absolutely well worth, <coughs> excuse me, still eating, well worthwhile making. Go ahead and make this up. Let us know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching guys and see you next time. Of course, I'm gonna have more. Mm, this is good. Mm.